Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. I have update number eight to project Use It Up. This is just where I pick 10 things to try to use up completely. Um, and let's go ahead and get started. So the first thing I had in here was a body wash. This one's from Bath and Body Works and it's in the scent Tutti Fruity Candy. And it is also called Happy Easter. They do this one at Easter and it's called Tutti Fruity Candy. Um, at the intro, it was full. That was the last update and I finished it for this month. Super easy. These are This is a little mini one. Um, three fluid ounces. I finished it up rather quickly. It's a very fruity berry scent. I think the scent notes are like sugared lemon candy. And that's what it smells like. It's very like tart and tangy like lemon, but still super, super sweet like candy. It really does smell really um, candy like. So that is empty and it's rolling out. Next, I will do the matching body mist for this one. Once again, Happy Easter 2D Fruity Candy from Bath & Body Works. This is the Diamond Shimmer Mist in a mini. Um, you can see a little bit left at the bottom. It's like this light blue stuff. I couldn't spray any more out, but it is gone. So there's that little bit at the bottom. Um, same scent notes and this one was also three fluid ounces super fun to wear because of the shimmer in it um smelled super good super candy like okay this was it when i rolled it in you can barely see that line but it's right there um and then i was halfway done that month and this was where i was at last month and this is how much i finished this month super fun and easy to use Okay, next is another one I finished. This is um, from a brand called Beauty Concepts. This is a makeup brush cleaner. I used it to clean my sponges twice this month and my brushes once this month. Um, so at the last month, it was full. I got down to there last month. Is that right? Anyways, I used that much this month. So the other half this month, it was super easy to use. I just spray it in the water and on the sponges and stuff. And it was very watery. So it didn't even create many suds. I actually am glad I have my brush cleaners out of my collection because I rather use a unscented bar of soap. It gets the makeup off, makeup off so well and so easy, super quick. And you know, uh, unscented bar soap is super cheap. Okay, next is a Ulta Beauty lip gloss. This is a shiny sheer lip gloss from Ulta. You can see it's like half full now. And these are my lines. So that's where I was at the intro. And that was last month's update. And this is this month's update. Sorry, not at the intro. I didn't roll this in at the intro, but it's going so fast. It is like this tiny little one, but it's going so fast. If I use this more often, I could easily finish this in a month. Um, it is this really pretty like, what is it called? Like duochrome-esque. Like it looks clear, but then you'll catch these like purple reflex in it. Super cute, super fun, easy to wear. It does have one of those brush tips, which isn't a big deal, but I do like using up these little mini ones because you can see progress so well. So that one's going good, but it's staying in till I finish it. Next is from Wet n Wild. This is a Photo Focus matte, matte finish setting spray. Um, it's almost gone, but I didn't finish it because I was working on another one as well. But I mean, I'm not upset about it. I use setting spray every day. So like, I don't need it to go fast. Do you know what I mean? Um, so this one's staying in with the tiny bit that's still left in it. Next is the other thing I finished. So I finished four things. Um, this is the fourth. <laughs> this is a powder foundation from LA Girl. Um, it was fine. It only had the tiniest bit left in it. And I did use it all. 
So it is completely gone and I was glad to use it up, but also it was a pretty good powder. So that was probably cheap too, cause it's LA girl. Okay. Next is a mascara. This is from Essence. This is the I Heart Extreme Crazy Volume. I am wearing it today, but I've had it on for a few hours. So it may not be holding as well. I do actually like these makeup brushes that have this tiny little spiky applicator like that because it actually helps um like curl my lashes um my lashes are somewhat long but they are very straight so I need something that curls them and this one kind of does it not my favorite by any means but it's super good for a five dollar mascara so that's an I Heart Extreme Crazy Volume and it's still going um Next is the Clinique Pretty Easy Liquid Eyelining Pen. I think that's what it says. Um, it is a really good eyeliner. That's what it looks like. It actually has like a brush and felt tip kind of thing going on. Super easy to do a wing with. It's still going. I rolled it in last month and it's working great still. Um, next is the primer I've been using. So I only am working on two primers, actually three right now, but one of them's in like a project 20 uses. Um, this is my main one though. This is the Ren Perfect Canvas Clean Primer. Um, silicone free. It's very watery. Can you see it in there? Very watery. Um... But yeah, that's how much I use this month because it takes like two drops on your face because it's so watery and it smells so good. It smells like, kind of like smells like if there's such thing as like cherry floor cleaner, like it smells clean and like cherry. It smells so good. My favorite primer of all time. I love these like super lightweight primers, um, but I do need to use it because I've had it for a while. So that's where I'm at right now. Um, next month I expect to be like halfway through it, but that's how we're going so far. And last but not least from last month, we have, let me go ahead and mark it actually, cause I made really good progress on this and I did not expect to. Okay, so. This is a Victoria's Secret Color Shine Gloss. This is from a while ago. Um, the color is called Peekaboo. It's just this like light pink shade. It does have some shimmer in it. If you can see kind of the progress line, you can see it settled down right here. Um, this is where I was at last month. That's where I'm at now. And I didn't even use it that much. I mean, it is a skinny tube, so maybe that's why it's going so fast. But I only took this to work like two days this month. And I think that's all I used it. So if I just took it maybe five or more days, I could probably finish it. We'll see how that goes. But this is just a really cute, um, like barely there color. Once it's on your lips. Here it is right there. Still performs so great. I'm excited about how fast this is going. I did not expect that at all. And we'll see what I can do this month with only that much left. And I will take the stopper out and stuff. Okay, four new things rolling in. So let's see what we have rolling in. First of all, it's kind of like an out there product. This is from Good Molecules. I received this as a gift with purchase from Ulta and it's like a full size big thing. This is actually a B5 hydrating body serum. Um, So hydrating body serum, I'm assuming you would use it like a lotion. It is unscented. And it's super, super, super light. Like not like a lotion, you can see it kind of dripping like a lotion wouldn't do that it is more like a serum um this is 6.7 fluid ounces I don't think I'll finish it this month but I will be using it kind of like a lotion I am trying to finish two other lotions so this will get the back burner um 
but we'll see if I use it any the next month. Okay, next is another powder foundation because I needed to roll in another powder ASAP. This is from e.l.f. This is the Camo Powder Foundation. I got mine at TJ Maxx for two bucks on clearance a while ago. Um, I have the shade Fair 125 Cool. So we'll see if this is a good shade. I don't know. It actually doesn't look that fair, but let's see. Let's just put some on my face right now. Okay, yeah, it's pretty fair. I probably shouldn't have done that because I don't think I have powder right there. Okay, yeah, it's not going to. Okay, it kind of blended in. We'll just pretend I didn't do that. Anyways, <laughs> that's what it looks like. Still pretty much brand new. Um, there it is right there. Okay, maybe it's too light for my skin. That was just a bad, like, comparison of putting it up there. But I can just warm my face up with bronzer, so I'm still going to use this. I think I'm still going to... Well, Project used it up. I have to finish it. So, brand new um, 8 gram powder. This should last me a while, but I do go through face powders really fast. But it should last me a while. Because the last few I've gone through because they just had a tiny bit left. So, okay, next is a mini perfume. This is from Catherine Melandro. Melandrino? I don't know. But I, I definitely got this set at Ross. It's like a mini set. I think they're all 0.5 fluid ounce sprayers. Um, all from this... Catherine Melandro, and this one's called Unconquered. Now, I don't know if you can see through the packaging, but I can. See see where it is? I'll have it sideways. It's right there. So not quite halfway, but honestly, I will definitely finish this this month because when I put a perfume like this in my work bag, I use it on my breaks and stuff, and it goes really fast. And last time I finished up like a one fluid ounce one and this one's only 0.5 and it's like pretty low um so yeah i will this will probably be done by next month but it is on my list of ones to finish so that'll be an easy finish because i want to make a new list of ones i want to finish anyways um it's kind of just like a creamy floral scent it's pretty basic I know when I bought it in that set, the set of four of them was literally like $10 maybe. So I don't, maybe it's just not an expensive brand. I don't know. Okay. And last but not least, this is a lip product. This is from Model Co. You can't really see it. I got this in the Ipsy bag a long time ago. I used to love this because it's a lip lacquer. So it's like a lip gloss, but like super pigmented in color. Um, here it is right here. It doesn't have a shade name. I definitely got this in an Ipsy bag though. And like, this is kind of like a jelly gloss almost. Like it's super like sheer, but pigmented at the same time. It's just such a comfortable formula. I have taken the stopper out probably a long time ago. That's all that's in there, but I can still reach it with this so i'm gonna see how much i can finish this could possibly be gone next month too i mean look how much is in there it's only this at the very bottom and keep in mind this is already a mini like look how low it is right there i probably will try to finish this this month because I, I do actually really enjoy that lip product okay that's all i have for this month and i'll be back in another month with update number nine because this is update number eight. But thanks for watching. Bye.